you've prayed about this a long time and planned for it and God provided in an unusual way. Today, what we want to do is publicly recognize God's calling upon Jacob Riggs to Central Free Will Baptist Church and we want to recognize as a church body and officially confirm that call. This is a public installation of Jacob Riggs into the ministry of pastoral leadership among this people. Jacob's call to ministry in general has been confirmed by the Cumberland Association of Free Will Baptists in Tennessee and it will be transferred to the Wolverine Association of which Central is a part in our next meeting in the month of March. But we find the the import of this commission in part in the words that Paul sent to Timothy, a new young pastor in a new church. Paul said this to Timothy. 1 Timothy 4 verses 11 through 16. Command and teach these things. Let no one despise you for your youth, but set the believers an example in speech, in conduct, in love, in faith, in purity. And until I come, in other words, Paul said, until I come back to you, Timothy, in the church where I've placed you, where God has placed you, devote yourself to the public reading of Scripture, to the exhortation and to the teaching of that Scripture. Practice these things Immerse yourself in them so that all may see your progress. Keep a close watch on yourself and on that teaching. Persist in this, for by doing so you will save both yourself and your hearers. Acknowledging today that this new relationship brings with it new responsibilities between himself and Central Church we would like to ask a few simple questions of Jacob regarding his intentions, his desires, and his hopes for this ministry. They're yes and no questions. We're not having him preach this morning, okay? Th that will come. But also, in light of this new relationship, I'm going to be asking you or us the people who make up Central Church for an equal commitment regarding our intentions, hopes, and desires regarding Jacob's ministry in this place. So Jacob, four simple questions. Do you affirm today God's calling upon your life to minister to those who make up Central Free Will Baptist Church? I do. Do you affirm today that the ministry awaiting you here can only be fulfilled under the influence and guidance of the Holy Spirit of God and do you seek his help in this task? I do. Do you commit yourself today to the purposes of God for this people as he reveals them to all of us through his word? I do. And finally, do you pledge, first of all, to maintain a regular and vibrant relationship with God and your family that will serve as a model to others? I do. Congregation, would you rise, please? Do you affirm today Jacob Riggs as a newly appointed assistant pastor in this church? Okay. Do you commit to obey God's word as Jacob faithfully preaches and teaches it? Do you pledge to him your support and prayers? To confirm this installation in the sight of God and the sight of these witnesses uh, with the deacons in a prayer, we want you to join a dedication and consecration of Jacob and, and Lindsay. We're going to ask Lindsay also to come kneel at this altar and representing all of us I'd like to ask our deacons to come forward the spiritual leadership uh, of this church at this time and uh, we're going to pray and seal with God's approval 
what uh, he has done among us. Lindsay, come right here. You and Jacob, kneel right here. We're going to gather around you. And Rob's going to pray with us. Father, as we have committed in our minds to dedicate our lives to your service, to upholding Jacob and Lindsay and their ministry here, Father, I pray that you would send your spirit to change our hearts to that purpose, mm. that this com community of believers uh, would become a fellowship of love and support to each other, that we may not only reach the Royal Oak community, as well as the far reaches of this world, Father. It's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.